Children, can you guys either be behind me or like somewhere out of people's way, please? It's like the 11 year old's version of a stroller, evidently. We're back now with a look at the new season of Kate Plus 8. Kate Gosselin, they're trying to keep everything under control. Amy sat down with the mother of eight as her family gets ready to return to reality TV, Amy. That's right, Robin. For the past decade, we've watched the Gosselin children grow up in front of the cameras, each new season presenting its own challenges and in some cases controversies. And this season, well, it's no different. For 10 years, we've watched the Gosselin family seeing the highs, the lows, and the messes that come with raising eight kids. What's harder, toddlers or teenagers? I believe that some days babies would be easier, and that really scares me, because that was really hard. <laughs> now back for a fifth season of Kate Plus Eight. <laughs> Kate, divorced since 2009 from John, is a single mom to 16-year-old twins Maddie and Kara, and 12-year-old sex toplets Leah. Hannah, Alexis, Joel, Aiden, and Colin. How are you different than that Kate from 10 years ago when you were first starting out? I almost don't even know her. Now, it's like the wisdom, the experience, it makes you really a better parent. We see your son Colin in this new season, but a few months ago you revealed that he is away seeking treatment for educational and social challenges. How did you come to that decision? It had to be a really tough one. It was not even really a choice. It was uh, on the advice of his uh, doctors and it, it had to happen. How's he doing? He's plodding along and we are too, but it definitely was necessary and I'll go to the ends of the earth for the best for each one of them, um, this is the best thing I can do for him right now. And so that comforts me. Is there any contact? Oh yeah, definitely. Um, but it's not the same as being at home. There are reports that Colin told staffers at his treatment facility that he was abused by you and child services reportedly opened an investigation. I'm in the public eye. I've been investigated many times. It's always unfounded, obviously. So they're all unfounded? Yes, absolutely. John said that he has no idea where Colin is and that he has not seen him in a year and a half. He claims that you won't tell him where Colin is. We are both court ordered not to speak about the care and custody of our children in detail. I've known all along where he is, but the world doesn't know. And I'll leave it at that. John's in that world. John says he's going to court. Uh, to get a judge to force you to reveal Colin's whereabouts. Are you prepared to take him on legally? I've lost track of how many times he's said that. I'm really focused less on what John has to say. I don't really pay attention, to be honest. Now looking back, the 41-year-old says she's thankful to have a decade's worth of caught-on-camera memories of her family. I wanted those moments documented and Sure enough, got you've got a 10 vault. years worth, and I will never, ever regret that. Another thing she doesn't regret, that famous hairstyle. I mean, you were a Halloween costume. Oh, yeah. Somebody made a lot of money off that wig, not me. I have one of it. Wait, we you, just have, did... you have one of the wigs? Yeah, oh. I got a hold of one somehow. <laughs> Maybe one day I'll pick them up at the bus stop wearing it. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll get out and be like, kids, I'm over here. <laughs> Now, John's attorney told ABC News the whole story is not being told. John is a loving and caring father who is acting within the scope of the law to do what is best for his kids. Kate Plus 8 premieres tomorrow on TLC, and it's interesting because Kate knows that, you know, they show the good, the bad, and the ugly, and she's a tough mom at times, but she's, we're not an Instagram family where we're just all smiling and everything's happy, and she thinks it's important for people to see that families are messy, and it is mm -hmm. tough, but you can get through it with love. I just think about way, way, way back when, <laughs> when that first started, remember? Mm -hmm. When the show first started? So we just just one hour. Yeah. And it, it was only 10 years. Yeah, hour. it was just yeah. a one hour special. Yeah. And it turned into 10 people years fell in love way back then. Oh, we wish them the very yeah, best. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah.